What's howling, Lobos? Welcome back to La Mesa Live. Today is Tuesday, February 13th. I'm Marie, and this is my co-anchor, Joy. Please stand and join us for the Pledge of Allegiance. Put your right hand over your heart. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Hey Lobos, today is the last day that ASB is still selling friendship grams, which will include a plush rose and a message on a heart for only $3. Order yours at the ASB window. In honor of Valentine's Day, the library invites you to share the love. Book love, that is. Stop by the library to share one of your favorite titles. The first 50 students to share will get a small treat. Calling all ballers. Our Lobo three on three basketball tournament is here. Tournament winners take on the staff b-ball team. You will need a team of three to sign up. Sign-ups will be today on the outside stage. Hope to see lots of participation. No student team has been able to upset the staff team yet. Is this the student's year? Sign up today. Dude, be nice, Dude, be nice club members. Please, as many of you as possible, come to the NPR at lunch. We are going to do more Valentines for the retirement home and also divide clothes up for the assistant league. Robotics practice is today after school from 3.20 to 4.30 in room 505. Come and help us prepare for the spring showdown in April. See you all there. And now, a rare glimpse into another elective class on our campus. because I get to work with um, a lot of people and it, um, all, these are, all these people are amazing and they're like really fun to work with. And I also like it because you get to design pages and make the, your book come to life. I chose your book as my elective because I thought it would be a new fun experience for me. I chose your book as my elective because I love taking pictures and I like to show off my creativity. as for you need to design the yearbook pages. You need to work with technology since everything's going to be on a computer. Um, I think the coolest thing we've learned on the yearbook so far is how to arrange different shots and how to carry out a theme throughout the book because it really makes a book individual from the others. the opening page it's basically one of the first pages you see when you open the book and it defines what the book is uh, about and what the school is about right now I am yeah. editing my team page for your book um, yes because all of the people are so nice and you get you get to learn new things on the computer Students can purchase the yearbook throughout the school year. Um, right now it's $50. It went up from the original $45 price at the end of the first semester. It'll be $50 until the book arrives in May. You can purchase the yearbook any day by going up to the ASB window with $50. 
and asking to be put on the list of students who have bought a yearbook. Once the book arrives, which will be the middle of May, the book price goes up to $55, and then we only have enough copies from what we ordered. So once we run out, then the book is not available after that, but there are plenty of copies to be purchased still available, yes. Today in History. On February 13, 1959, the first Barbie doll made its debut at the American Toy Fair in New York City. Today is also the birth date of, of recent NFL Hall of Fame inductee Randy Moss. He is 41 years old. The word of the day for today is pundit. It is a noun. The definition is a learned person who gives authoritative opinions, an expert or critic. A sample sentence would be, we didn't know if the movie would be any good, so we went online to a ratings website where they had many different pundits reviews. Something you should know about today. Today is National Tortellini Day. Gwendolyn positively affirms Caitlin for being the realest person she has ever met Way to go, Caitlin. Nicole positively affirms Mrs. Garcia for being a very nice teacher, and she hopes to learn even more as the year goes on. Way to go, Mrs. Garcia. Joy positively affirms all the La Mesa staff. She wants to thank all of you for the work you do, and she is so thankful for you. Way to go, La Mesa. Well, that's our show. Thanks for watching. We'll see you back here tomorrow. And for Marie and the entire crew of La Mesa Live, I'm Joy. Have a Tortellini Tuesday. <laughs>